Happy Easter from Tina, myself, and everyone else here at Snake Discovery. Last year for Easter, you may recall we uh, celebrated by stuffing fake eggs with treats for our reptiles and then hiding them all around our zoo for an Easter egg hunt. Well, this year, we're going to use real eggs. Today, Ed and I are going to whip up some homemade reptile safe dyes to dye these Easter eggs today, which first we have to hard boil. Important step that yes. I should have mentioned. We're gonna hard boil the eggs, then dye the eggs, and then we're going to feed them to our reptiles. And oh, apparently she will not have one. Well, oh. I don't know. She does look pretty interested. Maybe she will eat one of them. Well, after we're dyeing them, we're gonna see which of our reptiles will eat Easter eggs today. So a long time ago, a couple years ago at this point, a very thoughtful family sent us after learning, I don't know how to hard boil eggs myself, sent us an egg cooker. And I have been using this ever since to yeah. hard boil eggs. She cooks a lot of hard boiled eggs now. And they cook beautifully now with they do. this. It's I will perfect. Say, they're very so good. I'm so sorry I can't remember your name off the top of my hand off the top of my head, but the fan who sent us this, thank you. I use it all the time. They're in a fan mail. I remember opening that one. That's in fan right. Mail. It isn't a fan mail. Okay, we'll have to reach back. So first I'm just going to set this up. to do so much easier than trying to figure out boiling times. That's why Emily can now hard boil eggs. That's the only reason why I it's can because it's a button. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> okay, so now while these cook, we are going to blend together our homemade dyes. Turns out if you just boil down some very simple ingredients, you can get natural dyes. So blueberries, just like with Rex's birthday cake, boiled down make a purple food dye. Beets over here, which are currently boiling down, will, as you can see, make a lovely red yeah, food looks dye. Like a deep red. I mean, yeah. it touched, it stained as I was cutting it. I feel like I could just color on the eggs with yeah. a beet and it would turn. We might try that. Yeah, we, might we might try that. Uh, raspberries make a pink yep. color. Okay. Pink. And how about the turmeric? That makes yellow. Ah, that makes sense. Yep. yep. So we have organic turmeric to make yellow dye. We have purple cabbage to make purple, I assume? Blue. Blue, really? Apparently blue. All right, somehow this is going to turn into blue dye yeah, we'll for the see. eggs. And we're going to, just to see what happens, boil down some blackberries and see yeah, if that gives I us feel another like color. It's going to be purple again, but we'll try it. We'll see. And we can even mix the blue and the yellow to make green, couldn't we? Yes, that was the plan. Okay, well, we'll see. We're going to play chemistry today. Yep. And uh, we're going to boil all these down and zoom forward to when we're done. All right, so we have our dyes. Yes. I don't know how good they turned out. Some turned out better than others. Yes. But First off, we need vinegar in all these. So the vinegar, which is reptile safe, is going to eat away a little bit of the shell so that the color can stick to it and dye the eggshell a little bit better. Supposedly. We'll see how well it works. Yep. A couple of the eggs exploded, so we took the liberty of eating those. Yep, so they were those, tasty. They were delicious. And uh, there's a couple here that might not work, unfortunately. But that's okay. Most of them turned out all right. So I have to uh, actually dry these off first. Well, that gives me time to mix up the dyes. They actually turned out pretty good. The beet red is like super red. So we'll do this one on camera, I guess. So that one like turned out really good. I'm actually going to pour more in because we have more. This is the blueberry purple, I'm guessing. Kind of looks red, but maybe it, it's, it's super diluted right now, or super concentrated right now. So maybe it's just a really, maybe it's a purple. Yeah. Who knows? This one is the raspberry pink. We'll see. Here's the turmeric yellow. That really turned out good. Hopefully it actually dyes the egg. Yeah, I hope it sticks to it. And then here's our blue. Now the problem with the blue, we use the cabbage for it, and the cabbage changes colors with the environment it's in, so it might change color in the vinegar. Oh, it turned back to purple! It just turned back to purple! Now we have purple, purple, red, okay, well, Yeah, it's, it's a light right. purple. It's a Dark different Dark purple, light purple, just red. A, a different shade of purple. Yeah. That's fine. I think it might be good for like some of these, like this one, to just throw it in. Okay. And just let it try. Yeah, <laughs> just see if you can dye the whole thing. Yep. Oh, that one cracked. Well, and one of the ones I wanted to see is if it like, if we crack it, oh, these like 
come apart really well. Yeah, they're really but easy to peel. Now, if we take it and just do that. Will it dye the actual we'll dye egg? The egg. Yeah. Oh, that's a cool idea. I guess we'll find out. So we are going to attempt dyeing all these eggs. We might try to get creative with some of them and we'll see how they turn out. Wait, we forgot to make green. Yeah. <laughs> Cause that only came with, our kit came with five egg dippers. So, um, uh, that's blue. all right. So. Should I grab some of the blue from sure. this? Blue slash purple. Oh, that's totally purple. That's though. totally purple. Okay. Do we even try? Yes. Okay. The reason it worked last time is we added calcium to it to make it. Oh, that's right. Just throw more calcium more basic, in it. So. Yep. Oh my there. gosh. Lots of calcium. That should turn it blue again. Maybe just a lighter purple yeah. mixed with yellow. We'll make poop. Oh, we made poop. Okay, never mind. Well, it might work. We'll throw an egg in there and see what happens. Okay, now we're gonna dye everything. <laughs> So we flipped the eggs once, kind of dyed them. They, some of them seem to work, some of them don't. Yellows, look I mean, at look this. At yellow. Like that definitely dyed the actual egg, which yeah, is and awesome. You can't rub the, the dye off either. The dye is That's, on there. Yeah, so we cracked, we purposely cracked a few of them just so that the dye would get into the egg itself. Yeah. And look at this beautiful hands towel. Yeah, that it turned dyes out, the, the cloth. Turned out amazing. Yeah. Too bad we don't need that. So now is <laughs> the uh, final, oh, the poop one. Is slightly poopy. It turned green. It oh, actually turned it green. Did turn green. Yeah. So that was not a total failure. Cool. And then we have all sorts of other colors. So we've got. Oh my oh, gosh. Yellow. Oh, that looks sweet. That turned out great. Those are amazing. Here, tip those up a little bit. Like, oh yeah. Those look. That actually looks like Easter colors. <laughs> it does. Should it go in the basket? Uh, dry it off first. Okay. And then it'll go in the basket. I want to like dry off the dye though. I don't think you'll dry it. Yeah. Oh you can dry yeah. Off the dye. It's dry. Okay. Great. Yeah. In the basket they go. Perfect. How about this one? Oh. Um, Oh, weird. Purple with a little bit of blue. That turned out all right. Let's see if that sticks. Oh, perfect. It did! Wow. Oh. Awesome. Okay. All right, into the basket. Uh, I think this one was in the pink, wasn't it? Yeah. Pink, okay. pink, pink did not work. Pink doesn't work. Unfortunately. Well, we'll oh, see. look at this one! Oh, that one looks sweet. That one's awesome. Nice, okay. This one we cracked open to see if we get, eh, it kind of, no. No, that didn't work. Purple. Yeah. <laughs> We'll start that one over. Look at this though. That's super red. Yeah, beets make a very good dye, apparently. So from what I can see, the beets, the blueberries, and the turmeric work really well. The blue is good. Raspberry doesn't work for anything, so. I think blue is just as good as the beets. That totally oh. wiped off, unfortunately, but that's right. We don't have a yellow and red. I'm just gonna yeah. quick dip this. There, now we have red and <laughs> Yeah, and then we have our green. Perfect. The green actually turned out halfway decent. Yeah, this is not too bad. Yeah. And there's all our eggs in one basket. That turned out n not too shabby, actually. Yeah. For being homemade dyes, that is actually pretty good. Homemade dyes and reptile safe, and I mean, we can eat it. To totally, yeah. I don't really yeah. want to eat shell, but. Nah, I'm good. But <laughs> now is the fun part, where we get to feed our Easter eggs to our reptiles. Yeah, who are we gonna feed? I think we're gonna do Allie, the tegu. Yep. We're gonna do a hognose snake. Oh yeah, there's probably a female over here that's ravenous. Yes, they're very hungry right now, so I bet one will eat this. We could try the legless lizards. Yep, the and turtles will eat. Turtles, and of course. Yeah, we gotta give someone Easter's. I think Rex definitely needs a few. Yeah. <laughs> All, All right. Let's start with the hognose since we're already back here. Yeah, sounds good. So All right. who are we gonna feed over here? Well, I think everybody would like us to feed the eggs to Omnomelet, but <laughs> I mean, Omnomelet doesn't need encouragement. It looks like she'd eat it. She probably would, but I don't think we want to encourage her to continue eating eggs because she already has a bit of a problem. <laughs> so we're not going to feed the eggs to Omnomelet. Instead, let's try Lily. Yeah, she's right up front. She looks hungry. Hi, pretty girl. She was locked up. She was. Yes, you had a boyfriend, didn't you? Do you want an Easter egg? None of our hog noses have had egg before. Yeah, they're all really good at eating. She was going to take it if you were to put it in her mouth. Oh, she does want the Easter egg. <laughs> awesome. You can have a piece of white here. What are you doing? <laughs> the, uh, these were <laughs> hanging were on stuck. to the egg. Yeah, they were stuck <laughs> onto the egg. It looked like you were just like, haha, I'm pulling it back. Yeah, no, I wasn't. And then, oh. do you want the yolk too? You are developing eggs, hopefully. Uh oh, uh oh, oh no, that I'm didn't work. Over squeeze the yolk. Oh no, here, have more white. Okay, now I'll take this yolk out. <laughs> Can Emily squeeze this okay. lightly enough? <laughs> okay, do you want the yolk too? Oh, oh of course I want yes, the yolk. Yes, she does. 
I'm oh gonna, no! I'm gonna squeeze it and it's gonna break apart break everywhere. It everywhere in my enclosure. Great. Well, I'd say she likes it. Yeah. Now I have to change her water. <laughs> All right. Happy Easter. Happy Easter, Kate. All right. I'd say it was a success with the hog nose. Yeah, hog nose seemed to like eggs. So now we're going to mash it up with the shell to give to our legless lizards. We're gonna make a little egg salad for them here. Make some smaller bite-sized pieces so they don't take off with a huge piece and drag yeah. it under a cave. Or try and eat it from each other. Yep, there we, we go. We probably throw the leftovers from the hog noses in there too. Oh yeah, we can do that. Perfect. That one probably just stay in overnight. Yeah, that'll work. And the eggshell, we're gonna leave in there because eggshell provides a really good source of calcium for reptiles. And our legless lizards will eat the shell a little bit too. They'll definitely prefer the egg itself and they love the yolk, but that's of course the least healthy part of the yes. egg. So <laughs> hopefully they eat the whole thing evenly. Should we give this to the legless lizards? Sure. All right, all right. Oh, it looks like they're, uh, they're ready for it. They are. Happy Easter legless lizards. Here. Do you want your special snack? Right. Well, that one didn't want to eat, but I bet Legolas will want to eat. No, nope, you can't escape, sorry. <laughs> You're not Legolas. Where's Legolas? Legolas, come here. I bet you'll eat the egg. Here. She's like, I am so sleepy, guys. Yeah, I just woke her up. <laughs> I don't know if I want to eat right now. <laughs> Here's, we now have five Legolas lizards, by the way, guys. Not oh, everybody knows there that. Goes. Oh, nice, Legolas. Go, eat that Easter egg. Anybody else want to partake? This one just wants to come out and be my friend. Yeah. <laughs> Stop it. Oh, you kicked dirt on the eggs. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Guys, go away. Stop it. Okay. Nope. Stop it. Move your tail. Well. <laughs> they would eat dirt in the wild, so. That's true. I guess the whole salad is for Legolas. Yeah. Oh, it's so tasty and I'm so sleepy. <laughs> it's like waking up for a bedtime snack that's yeah. delivered to it's you. It's like you coming into bed, waking me up <laughs> at three in the morning, going, here, have this hamburger. <laughs> yeah, it would take you a little bit to kind of get moving. I'd be like, what? <laughs> but once you realized it. A hamburger? <laughs> All right. <Okay. laughs> And we have five legless lizards now. Uh, a few of them are rescues or rehome situations. And we're hoping that, I mean, we kind of uh, unintentionally set them up for more of a brumation this, this winter. This enclosure just got a little bit chillier over the winter months, not by much, but a little bit. So that might kick them into a breeding mode this spring, hopefully, maybe. I don't know. I think if we were to breed them, it would just be luck, but who knows? All right, well, we might let Legolas enjoy her Easter dinner because apparently nobody else wants to. So this whole salad it is now hers and happy easter turtles happy easter do you want some easter egg come here shelly come on here you go graceful <laughs> 10 out of 10 for the dive i'll give them the green one sure they can have the green one yep i'll yeah, just, I figured you'd like, just rip it up in your hand all right that'll work let's see if it like dyed the inside of the oh, yeah. egg ah. well, a little bit i bet if we would have peeled it you could see like lines yeah maybe well i have some good chunks here will you eat the shell too here <laughs> oh, and she peeled the shell off in doing that. Oh, and Taco took <laughs> Taco it. Taco got it. Oh, even the musk turtle is here. Aww. Wow, you have like every turtle except for one musk turtle in Shelby, here. Shelby, do you want egg? Oh, yes, she does. Taco, do you want it? Shelly, do you want to you try could, again? You okay. You feed that musk turtle. Here you go. Elon, there you go. Take it, take it. Aw. Oh, the yolk makes a huge mess. I'm not going to feed any more of that. <laughs> we do not need to cloud up this water. Oh, no, yeah. That'd probably be a good idea. Here you go. Who wants it? Here you go, Easter egg. Oh, let's take chunks out of it. Nice. <laughs> this is the way to feed turtles. Yeah. They can just take a bite. It's right there. It's right there. Come on, come on. <laughs> come on, Elon. Uh, well, taco. Turtles okay. aren't great at eating. There we go. Oh, I would say the turtles are happy with their Easter dinner. I definitely would say so. They have not had egg before, but that was actually a lot of fun to feed them. Yeah. <laughs> so we might do this more often because that was that was really fun. And the guppies get to clean up the leftovers yeah, too. They get to eat all the yolk that fell to the bottom. Yeah. All right. Next is Allie. Um, I think Allie might be sleeping. Yeah, I think she is too. Allie, I know it's late, but we have a snack for you. You were hungry earlier today. It's okay, wake up, Allie. Do you want some foods? Hi, sweetheart. Would you wake up for an egg? Oh, it's purple. It is a purple egg. It's pretty delicious. Do you think she would bite it in pieces? I bet she'd bite it, break it in half with her mouth, but try and eat most of it. Aw. Cool. <laughs> Here you go, Allie. Hey, 
you go. Jeez. <laughs> Get that egg. All right. This is my egg. I am going to take very good care of it. Yeah, you go hatch that egg. <laughs> Excuse me. Where are you going, Missy? Oh, and she dropped it. You go. Get it. Oh, she's doing the alley eat? Yep, this is the alley eat. She tries, and it comes out. She tries again. Try, Just... fail. Try, fail. Yep. That's... Try, fail. <laughs> that's how the alley eats. I know tegus can eat, so I don't know what's wrong with alley. <laughs> Alley's just very special. Ah. <laughs> oh, she's back on the move. Yep, she's going to carry it somewhere else and eat it. She's taking it on an adventure. Exactly. Do you need help, Allie? Allie says she wants help. Yeah, I see that. She says, Dad, she help says, me. I need help, and I'm guarding my new egg. You should give me one of those other eggs you have in the basket. <laughs> All right, we'll help you out. Allie, look what I got. Look, Allie. Dad's going to help you. There's a piece of egg. Come on, you can't, you can eat that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Allie, you're the worst eater ever. You're so cute, though. Get it. She got a piece. Oh, there's the yolk. Oh, the best part of the egg. Get it? Yeah. Very gentle grab there. Yeah. Good girl. There you go. Grab that nice big piece. That has some yolk in it. Get it. Get it. Oh my gosh. You are terrible at eating. <laughs> just, just <laughs> grab it. Oh, uh, there you go. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. Well, I'd say Allie approves. Do you like Easter? Easter's fun. You get extra snacks. All right. Well, we'll let you go back to sleep. And happy Easter, Allie. Rex, happy Easter. Do you want an Easter snack too? There is Rex's basket. I don't think you need tweezers with her though. I don't think so. We have <laughs> six eggs left. We're gonna give Rex, I think three of them? Three's a good number for I her. think so, yeah. I'll try to roll them into good positions or set them in position, but we're gonna give her the whole ones, not this cracked one, so that we have the least chance of her making a mess. Yeah. Do you think she'll smash them up or do you think she'll swallow them whole? I think she'll smash them. I, I think, think she'll, she'll swallow crunch them. them whole. Okay. okay. So I don't, think, smash I don't think she'll like break them into pieces. I think she'll crunch and then swallow whole. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I can see that. I, I'm, I'm on board with you in that. Okay. So All right, I'll try and keep Rex over here. Okay. Like in this side. All right. While you open the door. She's going to instantly run to you okay. when the door's open. Don't mind the poop she left in the corner. We just cleaned that a couple days ago yeah. and like she just left another one, yep. so we have That's to clean that. That's her cake? That's from her cake, her birthday yeah. cake, yes. So don't mind that, that is a tomorrow or next day project. Yeah. But she constantly poops. She always. poops every day. Don't so. get a pet alligator, yeah. she is so much work. Anyway, I'm going to get her door ready. She's gonna crawl out, I'm sure. So yeah. I have to come back out and call her into the pool. Well, so. I can try and call her back in. Okay. She knows you're going in there. She's already on the way out. All right, she's back in her pool. Rex, Rexy, 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 come here. Come here, Rex. I gotta get a really high pitch to get her to listen to me. Okay, Emily's rolling them in. Now that one went into the pool and instantly sunk. Oh no, they roll away on her. Did she, she push it away? She pushed it away and then smashed it oh, into the corner. Oh no, that's the worst spot to reach. <laughs> Don't smash it more, Rex. Oh no. Rex, come here. Don't oh, eat that oh. one. Oh, she's gonna... She got part... Oh, my gosh. She made such a huge mess. All right. Well, Rex, come here. I gave her four because... like The this one is... sunk? Yeah, one sunk. <laughs> <laughs> so she'll eat that one, but I figure four is a good meal for her. Don't eat poop. Rex, don't go... Rex, come here. Rex, come here. Come on. She's gonna get that one. She's gonna oh. get that one. Get it. Oh, my gosh. I <laughs> just get it. She doesn't like it when food rolls away from her. Apparently not. All right. So you know how you said she was gonna eat it whole? Yeah, she did. Oh, oh, she just made a huge mess. Why, Rex? Oh my gosh. Well, I guess I'll be cleaning all that up too. So happy, ha happy Easter. Okay, note to self, we're never giving Rex eggs again. <laughs> She's cleaning up the little pieces. She's trying. Oh, uh, great. Rex, come here. You have another one. Come here. Look right here. Easter egg. Easter egg right there. That one can't escape you. Just so, be gentle. <laughs> so I learned something about Rex today. When she goes to eat, she goes 90, 900%. <laughs> she does and mashes her face into it. And just squishes. Yeah. Rex, there's still a little bit right yeah, there. Yeah, there's still more egg here. Oh. Oh, oh that would have went down better. That one wasn't as bad. Well. <laughs> you say that and uh... then she did that. <laughs> Attempt one over there in the corner. <laughs> Attempt two, that massacre. <laughs> Attempt three. 
She kind of learned. She did. She just left the yoke. Except look oh at- Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh no, Rex. We just did a water change too. Well, she's gonna try to clean up some of the leftovers. I mean, we gotta give her credit for that. She's cleaning up after herself. She is. Yeah, there is that. Uh, well, we might be doing another 50% water change to get her to stay in her pool while we clean the entirety of her enclosure. Oh I mean, gosh. she's having fun. I mean, I guess that's what's important. Yeah. She's enjoying herself. It gives her some good mental stimulation. She's trying to not fall into her pool. Yep. As that's long as your she... gator, babe. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> as long as she's happy, that's what's important. Oh, uh, we're open tomorrow too. Yeah. This place is gonna be filthy and everybody's gonna be like, what in the world happened? I'll put up a sign that says, I ate Easter eggs last night and made a mess. Please excuse. Please excuse yeah. my mess. Yeah. Let's see if we can get her to go after that. Yeah. Oh, oh, she's gonna see it. Get it, get it. Oh, oh. She's trying. <laughs> it's right under you. Come on, come on, you can eat that. This is like us trying to get her to eat that mouse all over again. Yeah. <laughs> oh, she was so close. She wants everything out here. It's easier to grab. <laughs> all right, well, that was something I just learned and I wish I was recording. Rex can fit behind her dome. She has to squeeze, but she can fit behind her dome. And it's perfect time for Emily to reach in because she's stuck. Come on, Rexy. Rexy! All right, slight behind the scenes. Rex is still trying to clean up her massacred egg on this side, while Emily is cleaning up her massacred egg over there. Ah, the joys of alligators. Well, I would say Easter 2022 was a success here at Snake Discovery. We learned how to dye eggs with reptile safe all natural dye, and we learned which ones of our reptiles will eat eggs, which is a lot of them. A lot of, them. A lot of our reptiles like hard boiled eggs, which is good to know because it's fun to offer variety when we can. Except, we might not give hard boiled eggs to Rex no. anymore. I mean, she cleanly ate that last egg. She did get the last one underwater. It took a little bit, but she was able to get it. And that was probably the cleanest one that she ate. <laughs> so now she's probably going to spend the Oops. rest of the evening attempting to clean up her mess. I'm going to put a sign on here tomorrow for the public to explain why there's a huge massacre of eggs in the back. Do you want to explain what she just did, by the way? She no? doesn't even know what she's okay. doing. Let's, let's be real here. But it is an exciting time because it is Easter. So I hope you all at home have a wonderful Easter. Thank you everybody so much for watching and as always thank you to our amazing Patreon backers whose funds paid for everything for dyeing the eggs and giving eggs to our animals so and that the went, eggs. And the eggs. So you were able to give our reptiles a very exciting Rex, Easter treat. Rex thanks you. Yeah oh she's being face. cute. How can she how can you say no to that face right there? She's like I would never make a mess of my no. room. No never. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching everyone. Happy Easter and we'll see you next time. Goodbye Rex.